brought in over a hundred people who didn't really know each other that well. We brought them into groups and we got them to know one another, we got them to trust one another, to work together, to form ideas, and then actually develop a plan to make those ideas take flight. And that's what we did. We did it all using visual thinking. Abbiamo ragionato su come l'accelerazione esponenziale della tecnologia e delle problematiche di sostenibilità si può fondere con la possibilità di, di risolvere le grandi sfide del nostro tempo. C'era un'ottantina di persone completamente coinvolte dall'inizio alla fine. Spero che sia passato questo concetto di accelerazione esponenziale che io dico sempre è simile al popcorn. Non succede niente per il 95% del tempo e nell'ultimo 5% del tempo c'è l'esplosione tutto accade. How do leaders, creatives, organizations thrive in an era of constant change where the very fundamentals of their business actually may change overnight? The workshop was about a deliberate tool to help people break out of their normal comfort zone. If perceptual scope means the ability to see more, conceptual scope is how you consider what you see. So how you think about the ideas um, that you're seeing. Increasing your conceptual scope is increasing the categories in which you use to think about new ideas uh, and new approaches. The pain that you pour. Just for, just for. We had a lot of people at the workshops, a lot of interaction between them, a lot of passion. I was spotting people engaged, working on the floor to, to create and to give shape to their ideas. If you put a lot of talent, not only on stage, but around, things happen. The people that are watching the speaker start to do something. Let's say, evolving the way in which, or changing the way in which, they are usual to work. And this is the reason why we do Frontiers.